Okay, we're given a table and we've defined h of x to be a composition of functions, this f composed with g of x. So our goal here is to use the table and find the derivative h prime of 2. So first, let's go ahead and write this out. We want to use the chain rule to accomplish this goal. So the first thing I'm going to do is, remember, with the chain rule, you take the derivative of the outer function, you leave the inner function alone. I'm going to go ahead and fill in a 2 there um, because we're evaluating this at 2. And then we multiply this by the derivative of the inner function. So the inner function is g prime, or the derivative is g prime of 2. All right, from here, let's go ahead and we want to work from the inside out in general. So to do so, we're going to leave the f prime alone on the outside. And let's evaluate g of 2. So that's a 2 being plugged into g. So that's going to work out to be a 4 gets filled in there. Now g prime of 2, we can go ahead and evaluate that as well. Again, we're plugging in a 2, evaluating that into g prime, which works out to be 3. All that remains here is we want to figure out what is f prime of 4. So 4 as an x value gets plugged into f prime. Works out to be 2 times, bringing down this 3. Overall, 2 times 3 is going to make 6. That is our derivative of h evaluated at 2. Hope this helps out. Just take your time. Work from the inside out whenever possible. Good luck.